But if you weren't here last week, ladies and gentlemen, this is Doom to Hell. Uh, it is another game, much like the previous game, that I got on from Keymailer. So it is a, a free review copy. And I enjoy it quite a bit. It's, it's very akin... Excuse me. It's very akin to other games that I'm currently obsessed with, like uh, Vampire Survivors and Scarlet Tower. So I kind of fell in love with this pretty quick. Uh, it's a, again, it's like a twin stick shooter. So it's pretty pog in that respects. It, I was kind of expecting it to be the auto shooter like the other games were, uh, but it is not. And then between each round, uh, you get a buff and then you carry these buffs until the end of the round. Uh, and once that round is done, like it's X amount of waves and then the level ends, but then you go to a store where you can get permanent buffs uh, until the end of your run. All right, so knockback, money. Yeah, give me the damage. I'll take the damage for right now, please. Uh, I really like getting the rate of fire stuff and the damage. Those two things I find are super important, especially when you start getting significantly better guns. Um, like the starting pistol is, is just, not, it's not great. But eventually you're going to come across like shotguns and bazookas and shit like that. Defense, movement, and critical. Um, I don't really, I guess the critical. But I'll say the first few waves are pretty easy. You're not really going to have a, too much issue. Also, what's nice is there's no, it's not like the other games where you build up experience in a round. So it's kind of nice that the stuff just like vacuums to you. You don't really have to worry about that between rounds or anything. You don't have to pick any of the shit up. Like once the round is done, everything just vacuums to you. So it's really nice in that respect. Uh, health, money. Uh, I guess I'll take the money. I don't need the health or anything right now. All right, where are we at? Where are we coming from? I've already been seeing some of the bats coming. I've been killing them off before they actually get their little attacks off. But these bats are super annoying. Yeah. So they have that spread shot. And if you're near them and you're not like moving out of the target range, it takes up such a big area of the screen. Jeez Louise, how many more rounds is there of this? Uh, let's go with, just keep giving me that money. Maybe I'll get real lucky at the store and I'll be able to get a nice couple of upgrades. But I'd say the stuff at the beginning is relatively cheap. So I might get lucky. I'm already up to $423. So like I said, maybe when I get to the store, I'll be able to get either a new gun and a couple of upgrades, or depending on what guns there are, I might just be able to get a few of the permanent upgrades and just start getting myself buffed up before uh, like going too far. I just took a bullet to the face, apparently. Okay, so that was the last round. Excellent. Hello, shopkeep. Alright, so this is rate of fire, I believe. Yes, attack speed. So we got the shotgun. Increase the critical. And a submachine gun. But it's actually... The submachine gun is actually worse than my own. It just has a better rate of fire? All right, so let's go with the attack speed and our critical rate. Let's go ahead and just bump up our... Oh, we still have enough, actually. You know what? You have two guns. So I will run with the pistol and the submachine gun for right now. I had the money for it. No reason not to take it. Just hopefully in next round, I'm going to be able to get something a little bit better. 
Ow. Cause I'm not, I'm actually not really a huge fan of the submachine gun. It's not terrible, it's just, I don't know. I'm not a real big fan of it. I think it's because it fires more bullets, but it just has a little less damage on it. Um, yeah, let's bump my defense for right now. All right, where are we coming from? And what's kind of funny about this game is like, I'm not gonna say it's necessarily easy uh, because the enemy variety does start getting a little spicy as the game goes on. I also keep forgetting, I do have a dash. I just can't remember how to use it. There it is. So you do have a little dodge as well. I just never remember to actually use it. Give me that rate of fire, please. Um, no, but what I was saying about um, the enemies, the enemies start out pretty simple, but it feels like as the game goes on, it starts turning into a bullet hell, especially when you get to the very end boss. Uh, the, the devil is pretty fucking intense. There is a ton of bullets that just end up all over the screen. You bitch. Uh, restore life. Critical. And movement speed. Ah, uh, let's go with the critical. Alright, where are we coming from? Clear. Uh, nope, nope, nope. Not today. Okay, you can't. I was trying to remember if you could use the dodge while actively holding down fire. You can, it cancels your firing. So that's good to know. Oh, I am getting trapped in a corner here. Excuse me, pardon me, sir. No, no, I don't want more of you, so you can get out of here. Oh my God, so many bullets. There we go. Health restore, still don't need that yet. Defense. Uh, I guess I'll take the movement speed for right now. I'm always more concerned about making sure I get all the bats that come out of the gate. So I always take out what I perceive as the big. Just, when I stop walking into bullets, I try to. You idiot, let me finish my sentence. I try to take out what I perceive as the biggest threats and then aim for the smaller guys because most of the guys yeah it can get a little overwhelming when there's a whole bunch of individual shots coming at you but it's even more so overwhelming when you have two or three of these bats shooting at you and they're filling up almost every avenue with bullets all right so we're up to 439 coins let's see what we got today that's melee damage. Yeah, I don't really want a sword though. Or do I? The rate of fire is down. Damage down critical is up. It's kind of cool though. Um, Let's take the defense. So, it's got more knockback and I guess bleed. And it's got more knockback and it's the same damage. So I don't want to take that. So this is, this is literally the same no matter which I use here. All right, so we're just gonna stick with the weapons we have then. Cause I'm not terribly impressed with either of those. Where are we coming from the other thing that's kind of nice when you're playing this is uh, you can actually shoot through all the obstructions uh, but at the same time yes the enemies can also shoot you through the obstructions but it is kind of nice that your bullets aren't stopped by trees 
money. Give me that damage. I say I barely spent any money last round, so I should be okay getting whatever money I get from this round. It shouldn't be that bad. Oh, bat, bat, bat! Walked into the bullets. Oh my god, there's so many bats. Okay, I took out one of them at least. I was say there was about to be three of these things on the board. Rate of fire, yes please. So there's something to be said for like, yeah, having really bumped up damage is pretty good. But the, it, I feel like there's a pretty good balance between having a high rate of fire and low damage and having high damage and a low rate of fire. So it, it kind of feels like a wash sometimes. So a lot of times I'll try to focus on one or the other if I can help it. Oh shit, I do not like those guys. Those guys are act their shotguns are actually kind of bitching. Yeah, they're they're actually a little bit more of a threat. But I'll say the other guys, I, I always thought they were holding shotguns. They are just holding pistols. But they just kind of look like shotguns. Uh, potion of defense, knockback, and temporary life. Uh, I guess give me the defense. I haven't really lost a lot of life, and I'm pretty good with the life total I have. So if I can just reduce the damage that's coming in, I should be okay. Plus, I also have the permanent boost from the store. So any little any little buff on top of the buff I have is going to be nice. Ow. Oh, hello. Who are you? I forget what the sorcerer does. Oh, shit. Yeah, he does those big orb things. Oh, God. Oh, I would really like to kill a couple things, please. So the other thing that is kind of nice is if you shoot an enemy, you will do an interrupt. So if they're getting ready to attack, if you time it just right, you will interrupt their attack. Uh, I don't need to restore my health, so let's keep buffing that shot speed. I forget what gun I had, but I had buffed up my shot speed so high that it was almost like an, an unending stream of bullets, and it was really nice. Oh, get out of here. Oh, I thought that was the same. I was like, I was like, didn't I just kill you? Oh my god, I almost ran into that bullet. That was the slowest moving bullet I have ever seen in my life. Oh, depending on how this goes, I might be hoping for a health thing. Oh my god. Yeah, oh my goodness gracious. Yep, starting to get a little shredded here. Alright, we should be good now. We should be... Oh, little orbs from the ceiling. No, 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 no. Oh, good. End of route. Even better. Because you do get your health restored, which is super duper nice. All right, so what do we got this time? Defense and critical... Gosh dang, you're not really helping me out here, dude. I mean, I'll take the, the buffs to my criticals, but it's just it's not really doing a lot. I mean... It's, just, it's a lower rate of fire. I don't see it being very good. And that's lower... It's, ah, you're killing me, dude. Give me some shit that's actually good. I might end up starting to take, depending on if it pops up, I might start taking the health power-ups in between levels because I'm not getting a gun to really upgrade. It's I'm stuck with the starting gun at the moment and one of the slightly better than starting guns. And I think the only thing that's really saving me is the fact that I do have the higher rate of fire. If I don't have that, I think I would be really in a bad situation. Uh, rate of fire. I guess we'll go with the rate of fire. It's not what I wanted this time, but 
I will take it. Lucky shot. I'm just, I, literally, I'm just turning around and hoping that there's enemies that I'm shooting at. There's enough portals on this stage that you get kind of lucky after a while. If you want to consider it lucky that there's so many enemies that you can pick a direction and you know you're going to hit something. I haven't really noticed, because I haven't really played it enough yet, but I haven't really noticed, like, spawning patterns yet. Temporary damage... Uh, let's keep going with the rate of fire. So we're starting to get to, at least on temporary level, we're starting to get to good rate of fire here. So I might be able to actually skip if a rate of fire comes up again, unless, unless it pairs up just with something shit. Um, I might actually be able to pick a different buff. Because I'm now feeling pretty comfortable. I almost have a continual stream of bullets. I'm still waiting to see... Because I've seen, like I said, a shotgun. Uh, like a bazooka. I think I've seen rifles. <sighs> Defense. I'll take the money. But I'm still hoping for, like, laser beams at some point. Just like, or some sort of like, I think the shotgun has some penetrating damage, but it would be really cool if there was like an actual like laser beam. I think I had a chain gun at one point. So there's, there is a nice variety of weapons. The game's just not giving me any of those weapons right now. It's kind of boning me over. Oh, I still walked into a bullet. To be fair, though, I was actually pretty happy I was able to dodge all the other ones. Roll out of the way. Oh my god, all that's left is annoying enemies. Woof! No! Money critical. Uh, give me the money. I mean, at this point, I have a nice chunk of change saved up. 1,100 coins. Oh, first boss. I forgot about this. I forgot there was bosses after X amount of waves. So what you have to watch out for with this boss is you really don't want to be near a wall after a wall bounce. Like, because there, there is a very short delay with your bounce. And if you're in a situation where he can bounce off a wall and then into another wall immediately, you're going to have a bad time. Kind of like I am proving over and over again right now. This isn't so bad. I like when he does this. These are relatively easy to dodge. I don't like when he does his charging thing. The charging thing sucks. Oh my god. Sir. Sir. You're gonna go back to the stompy thing? That would be great. Thank you, sir. I enjoy the stompy thing. Get fucking Rex, scrub. Alright, did I miss any... I did not. Alright, so what do we got here? Increase gun damage. Ah, uh, yes. Until you die, your damage dealt from guns is increased by 15%. Yes, please. Thank you. 
Also, Mikey, not going to lie. I'm still surprised you're here. I normally see I'm heading off to bed or you've passed out. How are you doing in this wonderful Saturday evening? All right, what do we got here? The green rifle. Which is... Significantly better. And we got the phantom pistol. Well, let's take... Let's take our buffs first. I think I'm gonna take... I'm gonna take the Phantom Pistol over the regular pistol. I'm gonna try it out. I'm gonna see how it do for right now. I like to try and grab the chest early so I don't forget them. Because I have a habit of forgetting the chest sometimes before I leave. Ooh, that was almost bad. Oh, Jesus. That round was surprisingly easy. Uh, health, defense. Nah, give me that rate of fire for right now. Curled up in bed. If you ask me, that sounds like one cozy situation. Oh, you butthead. I can imagine grabbing the chest earlier being the best. It doesn't really matter per se. It's just, it's like I said, I just like to do it to make sure I actually grab them. Because I have a habit of like, once I beat the level, I head out. And then all of a sudden it's like, oh shit, I missed out on chests. Oh, I forget what you do. I don't want you to hang out wrong enough to find out. Okay, so this one does have some sort of like penetrating. So that's pretty cool. It's not exactly laser, but it's laser adjacent, it feels like. Uh, where do we got? Where are we? At? Ooh, okay. Little little tracking bubbles kind of. Damage. Oh, give me this. Give me the rate of fire. My rate of fire is going to be redonkulous here soon. Uh, can I have enemies? Thank you. Is it just safe to do this? This is a broken strat. There's no way this is going to work for the whole level. Holy shit, I can't believe that worked. Temporary defense, let's go. All three things are in a line, which means I can just shoot straight down. And because I have such a high rate of fire with some penetration, bruh, bruh. Get fucking wrecked, you scrubs. And we're moving on. Let me make sure I got everything. That, that was, that was very beneficial. Having all three spawn points in a row like that. All right, what else have we got today? Ooh, green sword. Big green sword. I might take that. Because that is... That is... I'm going to take the sword over that. And then I still have enough for all of the buffs. Oh. And... Oh, I'm sorry, sir. I didn't mean to do that. Interesting. I actually have not used a sword yet. So this is a this is an interesting thing here. So let's see how this goes. It 
does have a lower rate of fire. It's pretty strong, though. He looks like a little cat thing, but I could be wrong. I thought he was a cat. But he didn't deserve, he didn't deserve my ire like that. Oh my god, this sword is great. If I can just keep, if I can just keep doing uh, my, my shot speed up, or my attack speed, I guess, since I'm not technically shooting. And if I can not walk into enemies like an idiot. Oh, $200 though, I mean, let's go. I think eventually you can get these up to 300. You know what? We'll all take a minute and look at the, the little green man. And then we'll all have an opinion, Mikey. Ow. I think it might have even ex... Oh, yeah. I don't like you. Please stop. I think she's the one that has, like, a little homing scythe. Life up, life refill. Let's go with the life up. I'm going to switch to my other weapon, too. Now that uh, there's a lot more enemies spawning on me. And they're spawning from a couple different points. I'm not feeling as comfortable with the sword at the moment. Although, can you like... Oh, you can. Nice. So you can... <laughs> Quit walking into enemies, you idiot. You can switch up your weapon on the fly. So that's actually pretty nice, too. Uh, let's get the damage up. I wish it would tell you wave number what of what. So, like, I know I'm on wave five, but it would be nice if it said, like, wave five of six or five of five or whatever. Oh, I am so thankful her attacks keep going into walls. You can. You, I have two weapons uh, on me. I have... My, my big green sword at the moment. And then I also have my pistol. So anyways, I started blasting. Blah, blah. So that's what's kind of nice about this game. You, you do have two weapons. And I like to try to have two that are varied. He looks like a kitty cat to me. What's up, pal? Got lucky last level. You better give me some money. Oh. The soul launcher. I just bought... Mm. Nope. I'm buying my buffs. I'm okay with my weapons. But that is a... That is a very good weapon. You just gotta make sure your rate of fire is like way up. Because the launchers have such a low rate of fire. Which makes sense. I think I'm on a boss level now? I can't remember. Alright, so we'll try and... I'm noticing health vials. And I think they're... Oh my god, there's so many of them that are popping up. And I'm picking them all up anyway, so never mind. Uh, no, let's take the damage. As much as I wanted to take that money, I really want the damage. Just in case this is a boss level, I would rather have a little padded damage going into a boss fight. And if it's not, then it's not. And at least, in theory, I made it a little bit easier on myself. Although it's not proving to be very easy right now. What else have we got? Uh, yes, please. More damage. Where are we at? The one thing that does... Oh, nice. Two shots now. Oh, I don't know if it's two shots yet. No, it's still like three shots.
Oh, yeah, I hate that. See, she throws it. It slows down, and then it, like, arcs towards you. I hate that weapon. Money, critical, or movement speed. I'm going to take the money. 200 coins for nothing? I'll take that. Nice, nice. Got lucky with the... Oh, fuck, I forgot about that guy. Yeah, so there's a, there's a little, like, goblin suicide bomber guy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, howdy. So if I can not get any more of the little goblin dudes, that would be nice. Ah, uh, let's go with defense, because I just got my butt kicked that round. So taking defense is kind of like taking health to an extent because it does reduce the damage you take I shot at that tree because I thought the tree was an enemy oh oh my god oh no 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 oh fuck you with your shooting Oh my god, I may not survive. Oh my god, I was so lucky. If there was another wave, I was going to be in big trouble there. Alright, what do we got this time? Uh, that literally does like nothing. Permanent increase of knockback. I, don't know, I mean, might as well. It's not great. What do we got here? So the rifle, higher rate of fire, more knockback, more damage, I think. I still haven't quite figured out what these are, but this gun kind of sucks. So I think I'm going to switch out here. Yeah. I uh. Pardon me. So where are my spawns? So I'm going to assume it's left and right and then left, right on the bottom. Oh, yeah, it is left, right. Left, right at the top, left, right at the bottom. Ah, uh, damage. I will say I got a pretty good rate of fire right now. Oh, got lucky there. I'll take that. No, sir. No, sir. Oh! Nah, I still got hit. Damn it. So if you get really close to those headless looking guys, they just start really spraying at you. And they're like a touch faster than some of the enemies. Like some of the other enemies. Oh, what just happened, Mikey? If you're talking about if you're talking about Twitch crashing, that that that's not a shock. For for Oh fuck, that hurt. For a company that prides itself on being like the number one streaming location, like I don't know. I, I feel like they've got they've got a lot of work to do. To actually live up to that. Oh my god, I'm getting my doo-doo pushed in so bad. Money, rate of fire. I wish I had health this round. Because their mobile app is hot garbage. On a good day. Are you fucking idiot? You walked into it. Gosh, dang it. No, 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 no. Oh, fuck, I'm taking so much damage. Get out of here, goblin dude.
No, 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 Oh, yeah, he's like a mini bullet hell. He's actually not that bad. Because his bull... Oh, yeah, 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 I remember now. I remember now. <sighs> I call bullshit on a couple of those hits. So oh, I don't remember that. Holy shit balls. So he will, there it is. So it, he will send these guys out after you. And then you just gotta kind of dodge right before, cause they move, then they stop. And when they stop moving, that's when you know you need to dodge. Cause if you're still in the circle, you're gonna have a bad time. Don't mind me just trying to pay attention to the, Fuck you. All right. Permanent increase of health, permanent increase of defense, permanent increase of damage. Yes, please. Let's go. What do we got here? Good job, last fight. I don't know what you want, mate, but here are some items. Hope it helps, or whatever. Oh, what do we got here? I'm not sure if it's an issue of they just can't handle traffic or they just haven't built a strong platform. Dude, they have Amazon money. They have no excuse. So there's the chain gun, if memory serves. I can either increase my health You know what? Let's just go ahead and take the damage. I can't afford anything else, unfortunately. I wish I could have gotten just a few more coins in the last round. Uh, but we are we are closing in on the end of the game again. Oh, okay. Yep, forgot how their bullets work. They have nerf guns, it looks like to me. All right, so we will probably be focusing. Yep, I'm about to say, I'm probably gonna be focusing on defense, defense and health for this. I just wanna make sure that I'm a little bit stacked going into whatever final fights I have to go into. I had nowhere to go there, unfortunately. Ah, fuck. Oh, I do I do miss my other gun just a little bit. The green one that could shoot through stuff, I miss it. It's nerf or nothing. Ah, uh, rate of fire. It's risky, but we're taking the money. $300. That's a lot of money to pass up. And I have pretty good rate of fire, and I'm not terribly concerned about knockback. I forget what the plague doctors do. Don't really want to find out if I can help it. Didn't know you were there. Little bullshit. Oh, they throw fucking grenades. That's right. No, sirs. No, sirs. No, sirs. There, there are enough of you, gentlemen. There's only one of me. I need to go get this chest. Sometimes they put the treasure chest right under an enemy spawn, and I won't see it sometimes. So I don't need to restore my health. So let's go ahead and bump up. Let's bump up my health, but I don't need to restore it. All right, this is this is the way, but this won't be like the we just did the boss fight shit. But that's all right. That's all right. Even the temporary stuff is pretty good. 
I just need I just need to make sure I can take enough hits. So if I do shit, I walked into that. Ooh, that was that one hurt. I just need to make sure I'm at a high enough defense or health that I can actually afford to take hits. You have a target-rich environment, and their shots take up a ton of the screen. Yep, they sure do. And it's kind of funny because, especially the the like bouncy ball-looking shot, like it moves in a straight line, but because it's like pulsating, it gives the illusion that it's it's doing more. But the hitbox, oh, you fucking grenade! That was a piece of shit. The hit the hitbox for it probably is like the same no matter where you're at. That would be my oh, fuck. That would be my at least thought. Oh my god, please. Gentlemen. Whew. So I am definitely glad I took that 300 now. What's up, pal? Got lackey, got lackey. Better give me some money. Oh, rate of fire up again. What's this? Double pistol. I'll take that. It's considerably better. And then I'll take, yeah, I'll take that rate of fire. Oh my goodness gracious. So the rate of fire is better, but everything else is significantly lower. So yeah, yeah, we'll stick we'll stick with this. We're getting there. We're getting into a nice situation. Again, same same thought process though. I'm going to try and stick with oh, the slowdown is real. I'm going to try and stick with boost to health and defense. Oh my god, the slowdown is so intense. The poor switch, it doesn't know what to do. Because you saw how quickly hmm, rate of fire it is. But you've seen how quickly things can start getting out of hand when there's a lot of enemies on the screen. Oh, one of your bullets actually hit the wall. Nice. Fuck you. Fucking spawn camper. Alright, what do we got? Oh, that 300 is always so tempting, but give me the health for right now. I'll say I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm going to be good. I... I I don't know if I'm sold on the sword now, though. Like, the sword's kind of eh. Especially in comparison to my double pistol now. But I think, I think most of my coins are probably going to all go straight to buffs instead. That was a pretty good round. Um, let's go with temporary health, just in case. Do you think Cena is going to take the belt from Theory and break the record? For what? Most United States Championships? So he can be tied with uh, Ric Flair for most world titles and then have the most United States titles or something? I mean, I, I don't see, I don't see Cena winning. He's tied for world titles, not all titles. This is a conversation, oddly enough, we just had a couple of days ago. I thought he was still one behind. He is not one behind. He is, he is a 16 time world champion, just like Flair. 
and it's not it's not stacked titles it's it's individual titles so his amount of united states championships would have no uh effect on total title reigns overall if that makes sense well, that wave felt kind of easy i'm not going to complain it just just that whole round felt kind of easy a little deceptive all right so we only have 470 coins zip zap the pink rifle now i will i will take my my bullet damage please thank you i thought they were going to use this as an opportunity to break the record no he they won't it like i said it won't affect that for like i said for all i know it may affect the the record holder for most u.s titles because i know cena has held the u.s championship quite a few times uh if memory serves the u.s title was the first title that he won in wwe and i know it was back and forth for a while uh with other people Uh, good. Nothing really good here. Uh, I guess we'll take the Rate of Fire. I'll say I don't really need any of those, to be honest. So we're not, we're not at the Devil yet. You'll know when we're at the Devil. He's a ducky. Oh, shit. I forgot about the little duck guys. Get ducked. All right. Defense it is. I'll take that. I don't I don't know what they're going to do with with Cena and Austin Theory. Like y you think sometimes one thing's going to happen and then something else happens. Like when you when you look at Cena versus The Rock and The Rock actually beat Cena at Mania and, and took the championship from him and held it for a whole year. But, I mean, I just don't see them doing that with the United States Championship. Like, I just... To me, that doesn't really make a lot of sense. I, I feel like... I feel like it's going to end in a disqualification or something stupid's going to happen or or maybe they, they try and do... Cena versus somebody else like somebody what the fuck are you I forgot about you like somebody's gonna come out and interfere and Cena will technically win the match or whatever uh and they'll start some like news year long storyline but I I don't know it's like I said it's really hard to tell with those types of weird matches Like I said, the safest is it's going to end with a disqualification. Siri keeps his belt and Cena's like, you couldn't even beat me without cheating, blah, 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 or whatever. And then he gets to do his four moves and then go home. Oh really? It's it's going to be which night is that kicking off? What the fuck is this? The vampire sword? Shit, I can increase my health. This sword's pretty poggers though. Problem is, it's the same damage, it's just a little bit faster. I'm gonna take the health. I think, I think I'm pretty good with the double pistol. It's the first match on, ah, oh, here we go, baby! There's the Devil Ducky himself! So I'm definitely glad I took the health. 
So any any opportunity for health and defense boost, definitely gonna take those. Um, if damage comes up instead of those, probably gonna take that. Uh, no, I'm gonna take Rate of Fire for right now. Pretty happy with that. All right, well, I'll get to see that match for myself and have fun. Do they actually have a, a full card sum up uh, somewhere? Because I have been trying to find, like, an actual card, and I have not seen information anywhere yet. I keep seeing them announcing matches, but I actually have not seen, like, cards being released. I don't think I need the... I'm going to take the, the f this movement, actually. I about to say, the first form of the devil thing's pretty easy. The second form is where it really... You fucking duck. The second form is, like, where it really kicks off. And I kind of hope he only has two forms. If he has a third form, we'll deal with it when we get there. Fuck. Alright, give me the movement speed. It was posted on a YouTube scene as match would be kicking off the show. Okay. About to say, because it's starting to feel like I'm going to have to do... Because uh, I'm doing, I'm doing, for those of you not in the know, I'm doing a WrestleMania party for one of the two nights. And I like to do uh, predictions, which, yes, I mean, if you, if you dig deep enough onto the internet, I'm sure you could just find all the results and it doesn't make the prediction thing very fun. Jesus Christ, it's not giving me anything that I want. But I also do a little bingo thing, so I would really like to at least know the matches soon. So I can at least start working on it. Because I hate, I hate doing stuff like that the exact day before. I like having a little bit of time. Like, I probably could technically start working on the bingo sheet already, but it still would be nicer even to have the full card so I can even make up some of the bingo things. I guess we're taking the defense. Alright. Finally, after all this time, Rose, you defeated all the enemies that once inhabited this hell and ended the superpopulation. Now, as promised, you will go back to the real world. But only when you defeat your last enemy on hell. Me, the devil himself. The devil's a duck. Devil duck! Devil duck! <laughs> Behold, human, the most powerful being in this hell. W what are you looking at? Are you surprised with my appearance? What else would the devil be if not the world's most evil existence? A duck. Now get ready. You are going to have a bad time. Am I, though? Because it's seeming to be, Mr. Devil Duck, you are the one having the bad time at the moment. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Come on, come on. Ah, ha, ha. First form down and like no damage taken. What? This wasn't supposed to happen. I am the devil. No, I cannot die. I can't die. I am the devil. Now things get spicy. Oh, 
Oh, I am so thankful I have such a high rate of fire weapon. Oh, his hits hurt so much, though. Oh, I ran into a bullet. Bad. Fuck, my hitbox is so big. Not when we're this close. Not when we're this close. Oh. Bye. Have a wonderful time. Whew. After a tough battle, our friend Rose defeats the devil himself. Now, with the creature that maintained hell being defeated, this dimension starts to collapse and reach an end. When Rose realizes he is already back in his beautiful life on Earth, and like so, he finishes his life of adventure and battle across this world. Thank you for playing and helping our little friend Rose. Well, look at that. We did it, boys and girls. I'm just curious real quick. Nope, it does not carry over at all. I just was curious if it carried over at all. <laughs> but unfortunately, it does not. I just was curious like, if you could start the next run uh, with what you finished in the previous run. So, what I think I'm going to do, I think I'm going to do like I did last night. Um, we beat it. But what's nice about these games is you can, <coughs> excuse me, you can just keep going back and playing those games like over and over and over again, which is pretty fun. I always like that kind of stuff. We defeated the, the Ducky Devil. And now we're, oop, ah, goodbye controller. Picross. Picross time. And I'm just going to switch over to... Oh, you know what? I'm going to switch over to... Mario's Egg Catch Game. <laughs> Mario's... Super... There it is. Mario's Super Picross. Good lord. There were so many other random things in between there. You wouldn't believe how many games have Super and Mario in them. It was pretty crazy. But we'll keep working on our our stream file so I can keep I can keep my uh, my personal file going to myself. The Fatal Four tag team match? What is it? What is it for? I'm assuming the women's championship because that's how those things always seem to go. Oh, it's just. It's just. A, it's just a Fatal Four way tag team match? It's just a way to get people on the card. It, it, that happens a lot. That, it's a part of the reason they do the Andre the Battle, Andre the Giant Battle Royale. Alright, so we're looking at. No, it has to be down here. So. Oh, it doesn't have to be down here. So is it here? One, two, three, four, five, six. Well. We solved that problem. That's done. And those are done. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, so that's done. That's done. So that should be there. 
The women's has lived, so tune in. But I'm not a big fan of any of the men's tag teams in theirs. Well, it's gonna be, what, the Usos versus... Who? Kevin... Kevin Owens and Sammy? Yep, that's that's the only thing I could think of that it would be that would make sense. So there and there. Two, three, four, five. Oh. So where? Oh, it's right here. I almost goofed. It's glasses. What time is it? Eleven fifteen. Kind of hope we'd see them have to defend it both night and split the titles. Nah. Hopefully we're just gonna eventually get a title unification. That's what I'm personally hoping for. Shit. Let's try here. All right, so what are we looking at? Alright, so that has to be like that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Shit. Well, that's alright. So I'm going to assume that should be one, two, three, four. Nope, the five is actually up here. So, shoot, I'm probably gonna fail this puzzle. Two, three, four, five, six. So let's do that. Three. Four. So that's all that's in these rows. So this will be one, two, three. I hope both Rey and Asuka take their respective titles. I think they should. If they don't, I would be surprised. Two, three, four, five, six. Five. Oh, it's a little dolphin. At least that's what it looks like. Where else am I missing one? One there, one there, and one there. There we go. If Cody doesn't win, I'm going to be real. Like, honestly, if Roman wins, that's going to be the biggest, the biggest shock if Roman wins because it's it, it it's already reached a point with Roman Reigns where I'm just like you've put everybody against him and nobody can beat him so you you've made him so impossible to beat who are you finally going to make better than him because Lesnar can't beat him anymore McIntyre couldn't beat him fucking Cody Rhodes can't beat him I think I think the only thing I've seen that kind of makes it seem like, oh, this is a thing that might happen is um, they're starting to build a little bit of division within the bloodline. So it's possible that so so Sola, Solo, Sokoa or whatever the fuck his name is he might be the one that beats Roman because they're also so super protecting him. But that's still going to be such a fucking stretch. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so that definitely does go there. So that's two, so that can't go there. 
So does that make this? Because we've got here one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, so that's that. There. Then I'm going. Nope, not there. There and there. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Shit. So six. That's there. One and two. So that's all filled in. That's there, that's there. I don't know if that'll happen. There's also rumor that Rome will be taking a ton of time off WrestleMania, but always possible, I reckon. What are we looking at? Look at so one, two, four, five, two. I'm assuming it's like that. Yep. Little fishy. It's a little angelfish looking fish. I still could see, like, Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens getting involved in Roman's match and possibly using that as an excuse for him to get over simply because of the fact there would be a disqualification. But Lord, I hope not. All right, so there's only one in this row. Alright, so it has to be these seven then. And that means that's all done. So is it... Shit, I figured it was that. Oh. So that's done. Four, five, so yeah. So it's not going to be there. One, two, three. Done, done. Four. Shit. Alright, so that's going to be the start there. for me, so let's not go with that. I'm trying to see anything on here that's like... There's nothing on here that's like really speaking to me what the next piece should be. Oh, yeah, there is. Three and four, so two, three. That's done. That's done, so that's two. That's one, so that's done. That's four, that's done. Two, three, that's done. Two, that's done, so that means that is definitely those. Two, three, four, three, four, five, six. There we go. It's a fox? Not really sure what that is. It kind of looked like a fox, but it might not be. I'm indifferent on who wins the Intercontinental. That's the ugliest fucking belt on the planet, so I also don't care who wins it. Although, the United States Championship is also up there as one of the ugliest belts in existence right now. I hate both of those belts so much. Alright, 
Alright, so what is this? 15 now? So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Alright, so this is. Since it's 15, that means all these 11s I can fill in. What the fuck am I making? This one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. One, two, three, four, five. So that's there, there, there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Mark those real quick. What? One, five, one. Oh, I'm dumb. I looked at that wrong. So, five, five. Again, same thing. Shit. What am I missing? Seven one three. One five one three. There we go. Seamus will become a Grand Slam champion if he gets the Intercontinental title. I'm actually kind of surprised he hasn't held the Intercontinental Championship yet. He's been such a, like, mid-card champion for so long, but I guess they've just mainly been giving him the United States Championship. And it's like, and I do know he's had... Um, yeah, he's had both the heavyweight and the WWE championship, or like whatever the fuck they want to call it now, I guess. There we go. I was just trying to take out all the ones that I could figure out on my own real quick. So that's done. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that's nine. Excellent. That's done. That's done. So this is all filled. That's done. So it should be all seven of those. Same thing there, that's done. Oh, well there we go. Oh shit. Anybody remember floppy disks? Fucking kids will play this game and be like, I don't even know what I'm looking at. What What did I just solve this for? Not entirely sure they added Drew into the mix. Should just, Who all is in the match? It's... Who? Drew? Walter? Seamus? I don't care if he's Gunther. He's, he's fucking Walter. Fucking change his name from coming up in NXT from Walter to Gunther. Like, get the fuck out of here. Stupid ass shit. Drew versus Seamus versus Gunther. Six, 
same thing over here. I like the puzzles that have the same answers. He, he, his wrestling name is Walter, and then he was in NXT UK as Walter, and then he was in NXT as Walter, and then he's brought up to the main roster as Gunther. Because reasons. Same thing that Pete Dunne was Pete Dunne all over the place, and then all of a sudden, he comes up and he's whatever the fuck his name is. I can't even think of it now, it's so fucking dumb. not as bad as poor fucking uh big cast though one two three four five six seven big cast is just known as big bill over in fucking aew pete dunn is he's the shorter one in the brawlers it's like sheamus and two other guys i just can't th butch thank you that's his name Oh, that got lucky. Because I didn't mean to do that. Where the fuck is the one supposed to go? One, two, three, four, five, five, three, and then where the hell is the one supposed to go? Oh, it goes right there. I was looking at the puzzle wrong. That's why. All right, so this is all done. So 13's pretty easy. That's all done. So it's two. So it's three one, so that's like that. That's done. So one, 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 two, three, four, five, six, seven. Butch had a solid showing. He's a very good wrestler. I'm, I'm not even trying to say he's not a good wrestler. He was like the longest reigning NXT UK champion or whatever for the longest time. actually there that's there 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 uh, where am I forgetting one There we go. It kind of looks like boobies. I think it's supposed to be like a, a Shinto shrine or a pagoda, but it kind of looks like boobies. It kind of looks like somebody's flashing boobies. So what I think, I think I'm gonna finish out. Ow, my butt, my butt hurts. I'm going to tag out now. It's fun talking wrestling. It's been a, a bit since we've done it. It do be like that sometimes. I really missed out on an opportunity uh, on March 16th, not doing a stone cold day. But these things happen. Sometimes you just forget that things exist. So 
Probably what I'm going to end up doing eventually is remembering that Stone Cold Steve Austin Day is a thing. And I'm going to have to end up doing, like, some time off in March every year. Because you got Mario Day, and then you got Stone Cold Day. And it's just like, I, I kind of want to have those days and make sure I'm actually getting those streams in. Because I really enjoy doing them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine... Oh, I thought it was 11. I'm dumb. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And that's done. But thank you, Mikey. Have a wonderful evening. Get some sleep. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And then four. How dare you? Same thing here for at least that one's easy enough. So what do we got here? So, oh, shit, it's the other way. That's unfortunate, but we're gonna be okay. So five, five, so that's two. So that goes there, there. Oh, this is a, this is a lock and key or something, isn't it? All right, so that's all taken care of. That's done. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that's done. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There we go. Lock and key. It wasn't clicking at first because the lock is open. I was like, how is it a lock when there's just a gap like that? Because the lock is open. So we got four more puzzles on here. So we're gonna go either until I finish out the four remaining puzzles or, uh, excuse me? Shit, I looked at it wrong, you dummy. I thought it said 11 and 3. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Ah, uh, yeah, but we're going to go until we either get a game over or we finish out the puzzles that are remaining on this level. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so I did that wrong. So the three is actually down here. Two, three. What? Nani? There we go. Thought I goofed that up again. Could be two, three. So that has to be no, it has to be th there, and there. And that has to be there. Excellent. So that's 
there, there. It was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Six, seven, eight, nine. Six, seven, eight. Five, six, six, seven, six, five, five, three. So that's three, two, one, five, three. So one, two, three, one. One, two, three, four, five, six there. Two, three. That's done. Three, one, two, four. Two, one, six. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, one, three, so that's done. So one. It's not there. There we go. Perfect. It's a rocket ship leaving this planet. Lucky. Deep space can't possibly be any worse than our current situation on this planet. Alright, so this is going to be all the way across. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So that's two, 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 three, three, four, five, six. That's all the way across. Two, three, four, five. Just seemed to make sense. I didn't know if it was actually right. It just seemed to make sense. Because this is one of those, like, symmetrical puzzles. Oh, shit. Semi done. Two, 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 three, four. Two, three, four. Shit. So that has to go there then. So that's not there. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One. Two. Two, two. Hmm. I might get stumped on this one. I think it's a clock, though, if memory serves. One. Is indeed a clock. So two, three, two, 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 three, and three. What am I missing? Three, one, three. Ah, so it's down here. So I'm looking at two, two. there. 
Alright, so those are done. Two, two. There we go. Oh, damn, it was actually... So many of the other ones have just been stationary. I've been clicking by them so fast. But the clock was actually swinging in motion, going around the clock. Time was just flying there. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And copy that. Two, three, four, two, three, two, one, 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 two, 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 three, two, three, four. Okay. So that's all done. One and three is done. Two is done. Two is done. Three, there. Two, two, two. Uh, well, this is, there's nothing else in this row. Nothing else in this row. So that's not it. So this has to be one, two, three here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, it was a bold move, but it paid off. Oop, that's not what I wanted. That's all done. Two, three, done. Two, done. One, two, done. Two, three. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, one. So that's three, three. Is it here? I was a guess, but it was a it was a moderately educated guess. Oh, I looked at the wrong. Nope, nope, that's right. We want to do that. So those. It has to go right there. So that's one. Shit. So two, three. There we go. So is this the other one? That's one, one. And that's two, two, three, four. One. Six, six, All right, so where is the other one of this? One, two, three, four, or here, one, two, three. So it's one. Oh, the ones at the top. I'm dumb. Shit. Alright, well, at least we got that going. So that's solved. Two. 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 There we go. Oh, it's a football helmet. Sometimes I still don't even recognize what it is until they literally take everything away. Kind of a janky looking football helmet, but it was a football helmet nonetheless. And we are finally on the last puzzle of the round. So if we complete it, the stream is over. If we don't complete it, the stream is over. 
It's a win-win situation for me. All right, so two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Basically, it takes all the pressure off of me. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Two, three, four. One, 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 two, three, four. One. Eleven. Shit. So it did go the other way. Damn. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So yeah, so that's all in the middle there. So that's all done. That's all done. This is all done. And that's all done. So we've eliminated all of those. That's all done. One, 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 two. Five, two, three, one, one, one. That's done. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so, yep. Is it one, two, two three, four, five, six, seven? Shit, is it Among Us? It's starting to look like Among Us. It's three, one, three, so that's there. to be those two because there's a break it's one one two so there's nothing in that row one two that's one one what is this one shit what it's f I'm dumb that's, that row's completed. Two, three, four, five, six. Seven. All right, where am I missing? Two. There. Jesus. Yeah! Audio, please. You scared me. But welcome in. Thank you for that raid. Two raids tonight. Got a raid from Audio Blood. Got a raid from Lolly Diamante. Or I'm probably butchering her name every time I say it, but I say it anyways. How are you doing, buddy? How was I saw you logging into Sonic Adventure? How'd that go for you? What am I missing here? Well, that's unfortunate. We basically had that whole puzzle done. And I fucked it up. <laughs> I couldn't figure out what little bit was left of that puzzle. Didn't mean as many tries as I thought I would. Well, you know what? To you, sir, I say good job because I don't know if I would be able to dedicate the amount of time to Sonic Adventure 2 that you did I don't know if I'd be able to dedicate it almost to any of those modern Sonic games most of them are pretty not good although I haven't finished it I was really thank you I was really enjoying uh, Sonic Generations because I like the whole back and forth between like the 3D and the 2D levels. 
Uh, I remember having very fond feelings for um, Sonic Adventure and Sonic Adventure 2, but after like going back and trying to play them, I just mm, I just couldn't do it. So in theory, this should work. Let's see what great clip we get from you. No, oh shit, Sonic Adventure 2. Watch out, he's up to something. He's up to dying. What do you mean he's up to something? No. Did you just fucking die? Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? You finished the boss fight? And then if you stand in the wrong spot, you get fucked. Oh, that's messed up. I don't remember that. I am so sorry. That, That's incredibly unfortunate for that to happen. Although something like that did happen to me in... I want to say it was Sonic 3. I basically had the game beat. Like, I had finished... Like, I had beat the boss... But, like, I accidentally also touched part of the boss that would kill me. So, like, I had beat the game and died at the exact same time. And it was it was super frustrating because I believe with Sonic 3, if you die, you have to go all the way back to the start. And it's, like, a three, like a three or four part boss for Sonic 3. So, I, I, I at least semi-know your pain with something of that nature. But um unfortunately, as these things as these things happen around here, uh we're actually wrapping up for the night. Uh but I do I still appreciate I don't I don't know why I call her Diamante, it's just Diomont. As I just said, no matter what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna butcher her name. But I do appreciate the raid. Um and I do appreciate everybody else hanging out tonight. Thank you guys so much. I had a lot of fun playing the 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 Aegis Gear Alice Select CS Super Counter Strike Global Offense, uh, and I'm glad that I actually beat uh, through the run. I beat Doom to Hell. I beat the Devil Duck, and I had a good time doing it. So I beat two games technically tonight, and then played some Picross. So that's a that's a pretty good evening, in my opinion. Uh, now I basically need to go to bed and, and get some decent sleep because apparently I'm going to be gardening and stuff tomorrow and doing more taxes and just, just being an adult. So it's going to be a great time. It's going to be a great time. Also, hi, Gadget. How are you? How are you doing, buddy? Um, but that's all I have for you guys. Thank you so much. Uh, I'm going to, I'm going to take, I'm going to take your raid and I'm going to go raid... I'm going to go raid. I'm going to go raid Shep. Shep. I haven't raided Shep in a little bit. So we'll go out and raid Dep Shep. Um, but thank you guys. Appreciate it. We should be back Wednesday. Uh, we'll be jumping back into Brock the Investigator. I'm still waiting for a point where I can beat my son to death with a stick. The game keeps toying with me and taking it away from me. Uh, so I want to make sure I'm at some point able to do that just to see what happens. Uh, and then after that, I'm not 100% sure. I'll have to I'll have to figure it out, but it's still going to be Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday. Uh, but Wednesday, 7 p.m., we'll be jumping back into Brock, and then we'll, we'll, we'll suss it out from that point. Uh, but that's all I have. Thank you guys so much. Let's go raid Shep, Deppy Sheppy, Deep Sheep, and then I'm going to go to bed.